Okay. Look at Starscream. This is Naruto Fangirl XD and I'm her brother actually, but who cares? And this is Starscream from Doctor of the Moon line. And here's a size comparison with the Transformers Prime, Starscream, um, from McDonald's, which really isn't that well. I'll do a better comparison. And here's his mech tech weapons. You just this one transforms into a blade and is a gun. And this one is the same thing, but it, it doesn't really transform, it's just a blade gun thing. And if you take this blade out, then put these together like that, then it forms a double blade, and this thing locks in place. Normally, it goes back in unless you're holding it. Set that off to the side. And here he is. He's not that bad. He has two mech tech pegs right here, so I could fit in this, for example. So... He has some wheels there to let him lift off. These wings go up and down. Okay, time to transform him. To transform him, get this, bring him out. Put this in. Put. These are kind of tough to get out. There we go. That's one. And his arms are removable, so if they ever fall out on the video like this, it fell off. It's easier to get this out when anyway. Um they're actually removable. See they use a ball joint and I can put it back in. Hold on. There we go. Back in. And then these are his legs, so you just kind of pull them out. Kind of twist it a little. Then you get his legs. Flip them around, then put them down. And this wheel becomes his heel. Take this part of his foot out. He sort of has chicken legs. Do the same thing here. Flip around. Oops. Flip around. Bring foot out. Bring heel. Then you get this. You flip it up. There. You open this piece here. And push it down with a little force. Close this piece. And star screen. Since those were his, since the bottom up in there was his, the, was his arms, he does have some mech tech pegs there. Oops, hold on. There we go. So, if I get this null right, which is high, higher quality than this null right, I can peg it in. And then he'll have his null right. And I can also get this one paid into the other, blah, blah, blah. And if I get both of his weapons and then, oops, oh well. Um, then I do use his combiner. Then I can also peg it into his arm. Then he can use his double blade. Um, here's the Transformers Prime McDonald's Ball Bay, which really isn't, well, that Star good. Screen. Well, Starscream. <sighs> Sorry, I messed up. Okay, he, all he does is press his Decepticon symbol and he gets this gun. He doesn't transform at all. It's just junk. If you ever, if you happen to get this in a Happy Meal, I have no idea what to do with it either. Add something in the comment to destroy it with, or something. Anyways, back to the figure. He's pretty poseable. You can move around his arm. It's on a ball hinge here. So, then you move this up and down. Move his legs. Um, you can also store 
his weapons on his back in robot mode. There's little mech tech pegs there that you can put his weapons on and they do fit. Let's see. So that way when you're not using the weapons um, and you want to have them in robot mode and you don't want to lose them, you can just have them like that. And when I have them in vehicle mode and I'm not using them, I just put them together usually. But. So that's about it for him. There's nothing else he can transform into into besides his jet. These do move around. And you don't have to have this there. You can keep it down, but he, it's supposed to be up. So that's about it.